Hey guys, it's Jason at Hard Money Bankers with your Private Money Minute. We're still talking marketing funnels. It's a hot topic right now and I hope you're using them. So this one is geared towards real estate agents who want to set up a funnel to attract real estate investors, to help real estate investors. Okay, so follow through as I go through some of these funnels and I'm going to give you a tool at the end in order to uh, implement this immediately. So do your regular marketing, however you do it inside your business. Uh, if, it's, if it's meeting people at investors at groups or if it's meeting investors online, whatever the case is, doing internet marketing. So the goal is to try to get real estate investors to u- utilize you, right? To buy property, you know, to sell properties to you and then you get to relist them. So on one of your pages and one of your landing pages, the first step of your funnel is to collect their first name and their last name. And the way you're going to do that is you're going to give them a sample deal of a property you sold to an investor in the past that they made a good amount of money on that they flipped and off MLS and they made money on. So just have a picture of the property, either first name, uh, email address, so you can collect the new investor's info and say, hey, if you want to know how my client just made a ton of money by flipping this property, fill out your information, I'm going to give you all the details. So that's the first step. The second step, which next page, you're going to give them all the details. How many days it was on the market, where it was located, what the breakdown was, what they paid for it, what the... um, construction costs were, how much profit they made, everything on it. So you really get the investor interested to be like, wow, this guy really found his good deals. I want to work with him. So the next step is a call to action is for them to either reach out to you uh, to make an appointment or to fill out a criteria form related to the types of properties that they want. Right now, the goal of this is to make this pretty hands off and automated. So bear with me a little bit. So the criteria is, okay, where do I want to buy? You want to buy in Prince George's County, uh, this price point, I'm a cash buyer. This, 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 and this. They fill all of that out, and then you take that to MLS into your MRIS, and you put it into a queue, right? You know how to set up queues. So on a per-person basis, say, okay, anything 120-plus days, Prince George's County, this price point, I want to set up a queue for this particular investor, right? So then after that queue is set up, when they get sent to you on a regular basis as they're coming available, you want to scrape that and send them the ones that you think they should buy and why they should buy it. You can either do this on a per occasion, you know, when they come in or just uh, every week, maybe on a Friday. So this could be a great way to, to stay in front of real estate investors and show them true value. Instead of that real estate investor having to scrape MLS and looking for listings, say, I will do this for you because I know if I find this property for you, you can use me on uh, the, the selling side and I know that you'll let me list the property on the back end as well. So you're if not doing anything else to work with investors, at least do that because if you're sending them the listings In real time, kind of every Friday, at least you're getting an email out to them every Friday and you're staying in touch with them. So it's a long-term sequence that you can do on a regular basis. So again, if you're a real estate agent, I'd highly recommend this. Make sure the first page of the funnel is to give them some information to collect. Then you want to set up the criteria for them to, uh, and then put it in the MLS queue and then automatically it should work. So this should really, really, you know, after you get this thing set up, it should really only take minutes a week. That's it. Minutes a week. Uh, I'm always interested of what funnels you're currently working on. So if you have a good funnel that you want to share with the group, please comment below. Or if, you, or if you're a real estate agent and you need help creating a funnel, let me know. Happy to chime in on that as well. But I definitely encourage you to do this if you want to work with investors. And if you're a real estate investor, you should probably try to get one of your real estate agents to do this. I think it's a win-win for both sides. As always, like, comment, share, subscribe. This is Jason with your Private Money Minute.